and welcome back to another episode of RSMC Pack. This mod pack that I have made with the uh, RSMC mod at the center of it. Uh, this is not a public mod pack, which means that I'm not actually publishing this uh, unless... But of course, if you want uh, to know what's in the mod, you can always ask me for a mod list. Um, and because I'm not publishing it, it means that none of these mods were really used without anybody's permission. Hmm. Is this on a fire to cook it? I don't think I'm really at risk or at danger, so I'm actually just going to keep all my tools. I have a waypoint, so that's going to stay safe. And I'm going to, I guess, go off in a direction I haven't gone before. Uh, let's actually take a look at the map. So, I, my spawn is over here, so maybe I should go to the north. I haven't really gone far beyond the river. So, that looks like perhaps a great place to find some chickens up here in this area. Who knows? Uh, let's, let's go for it. North. Oh, that's downhill. I have to get back over here because I know that the stairs are down here. Perhaps I should make a bed. Oh well. I can find some sheep along the way. Maybe chop a tiny bit of wood as well. Just so that we have the resources to make a bed in case we need it. Or I need it to be honest because, <laughs> let's be honest. I don't have a room full of people sitting here. Okay, so let's actually take a look at the scimitar. Does it do more hefty damage? Hmm. I'm not really seeing much of a difference. But uh, I suppose that may become a more apparent at higher levels. Oh, there's a villager. He's wandered over here. So how much wool? Okay, I've got enough. So it might be a good idea to chop a little bit on a tree, or just chop one down. Let's do that. Chop a tree down, just so that we have the wood required. Of course, it's always good XP. Later on in the series, I might be doing some skilling off camera. Okay, let's let's actually go north. So everything seems safe to me. There's no real danger in sight. Nothing on the map that shows anything. I, uh, when I when picking the mod for uh, the map. I wasn't sure on exactly which one to use, um, but I actually decided on one without mobs on it. Uh, don't know why exactly anymore, but uh, I think thought that it may just have been a bit better because in RuneScape, uh, you know the lay of the land already, uh, especially if you look at the wikis and you know what you're going to encounter. But Minecraft is different. It's a procedurally de generated world. So I suppose I like to keep the element of the unknown intact. Hmm. Okay, so we have lots of sheep, but oops, took some damage there. Not actually the... Ch ah, that's what I'm looking for. Come on. Come on, little one. There you go. You're going to die today. And you know what? I'm going to be rather happy about that. Sorry. I'm going to exercise my dominion over you. Oh. Sneaky one. There we go. Ah, look at that. Slayer points. Yeah. Well, slayer speed, that is. And look at that, we have some raw chicken. And 15 feathers, yeah. I remember that, well, that is a common denomination. 
or drops. I think it's 5, 10, and 15 from chickens in in RuneScape. Uh, I was about to say Minecraft, but then I realized, no, I'm not actually playing Minecraft. I'm, well, I am playing Minecraft, but it's a RuneScape mechanic. Uh, or I should say a feature. Uh, fell in there. Oh, but now you're dead, so... Okay. I see. I see how it is. Oh, there's another chicken. There we go. Ah, uh, lovely. Absolutely lovely. So I'm thinking about getting two stacks of feathers because that just happens to be the amount of arrowheads I have. And getting lots of arrows will always be very nice. all the chickens I saw for now. I don't... Oh, there's one. There we go. Killed a chicken. seeing any. Of course, my peripheral vision might not be the best. Come on, chicken, chicken. Ah, there's one. There he is. Uh, he's just waiting for it, isn't he? Just waiting, aren't you? I think you can hide. Well, let me tell you something. You can run. And you can hide, but... Uh, I don't think either of those will be very effective against someone as powerful as the player. There you go. Killed. Wow, we have more than a stack now. But the more the better, I say. More of a merrier, more of a better. Uh, get that Slayer task done. This might be a good time to take a look up here to see if we can see any in a valley somewhere. Okay, just pigs up here. Oh, hoo, hoo, hoo. yeah, I can't damage him, can I? Yeah, I can't. He did a ton of damage to me, too. So I need to get my Slayer level up to 5. This is why I said that Slayer is actually very important. Uh, in normal RuneScape, you can probably do a lot of things without ever even having to touch Slayer, but here... In RSMC, you really need that Slayer to get up, because otherwise, you can just uh, get get wrecked, you know. I know, certainly. And who wants to get wrecked? I certainly don't. Uh, maybe some people enjoy getting wrecked, but uh, I, I certainly cannot be counted as one among them. Um, under any interesting structures. Ah, there's an interesting structure. Probably highly dangerous, though. Um, hmm. I think I'm a little bit too far to see all the animals. Ah, there's some animals. But the day is starting to 
get into the evening and I will have to find a place to rest so what better place than right here make a little mini base on the cliffside um, hmm let's see let's get one of these up crafting table and make a bed there we are it's important to put this down and get to using it right away before anything bad spawns anywhere near me and whoop de doo it's it's another day amazing I'll, I'll leave this here who knows I might need it someday okay um hmm suppose it's time to descend uh <laughs> that looks painful hmm yeah that definitely looks painful I'm not descending from there screw that heading back in the direction I came Okay, whew. Well, in case I need to make another bed on the go, let me just kill the sheep here. There we go. Very good, I advanced in strength. That's very good. Oh, level 50 milestone. Two defense as well. That's great. I have reached the level 50 milestone, which is actually very low, but... It's always good to have reached milestones. Don't see any chickens down there. Perhaps going this direction might give me some uh, some help, perhaps. Mm, no chickens here. There are some pigs though, but that's not really what I'm looking for. I suppose. Well, we've got more of an a stack, so might as well head back. Might as well. Now that's that uh, half broken up tree that we looked at earlier. That's good. Good to know that's there. Um, what kind of altar is this? Ah, cosmic. Nice. Okay, let's, let's get right back to base then and perhaps make a bunch of delicious arrows. That's correct. Arrows are indeed delicious. Uh, I am indeed the one who is an expert on this issue. Uh, if you ever want something to eat, something that's really good, get an arrow. I'm joking. Don't, don't eat arrows. It's not good for your health. Uh, it's actually might, it might severely negatively impact your health. All right, let's, let's do this. guess you can't bury all of them at the same time. Fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, 
Ah, uh, hello, Monsignor Merchant. How are you doing today? Hopefully you're doing well. And there's Slayer Master. Hmm. So let's let's get right back to base and make some arrows. If I ate an arrow, I certainly <laughs> think I would be bleeding. And the real question here is, why do I keep using the word certainly? Do I have some sort of strange obsession with it? Is there something more sinister? Something deeper? Something that you cannot see that's beneath the surface? Something perhaps even dangerous? Hmm, who knows? Maybe there's nothing, maybe there's everything. But you can never really tell, can you? You can never really tell. Alright, that's half of what I need. So let's get the rest of it. There you are. And I suppose it goes on the anvil. Uh, like so. Or or wait. Am I reading that wrong? Uh fletching. Fletching no, that's crafting. Fletching arrows. On an anvil, arrowheads, arrow shaft, feather. Okay. Oh, that's not an arrow shaft. Oh, that's that's what the problem is. Um. Okay. Uh. Let's let's find out what an arrow shaft is. All right. Yeah. Can't just put sticks there. How how could I have thought about that? Okay. Build this in the world and use a knife. Alright, so as far as I know, we don't actually spawn with a knife. No, we don't. So what I need to do to get a knife is perhaps craft it. Tools, knife. Stick and a cobblestone. Do I have cobblestone? No, I don't. Alright. Uh, wait, maybe I have it in a chest. I do. Good. And this is not really useful anymore is it okay so what I have to do is of course craft it here oh wait now I need a stick my goodness really being unusual today aren't I ah there it is it's like that oh wait no that's chisel ah the knife the knife um Crafting tools, knife, stick, and cobblestone. Okay. But wait, is that in the chisel menu? Perhaps it is. Uh. Ah, it is. It is in the chisel menu. Okay. Sorry, got a little bit confused. And got a little bit of crafting XP out of that. That's good. Dump the chisel in there. Come on. Why am I getting so much lag suddenly? Are there a bunch of villagers spawning or something? I have no idea. Okay. So then, now I have, I have it. And that means that what I do is I put down a log. And presumably I... I first read what it actually tells me to do in here. Come on, load up. There we are. Find the recipe, build the item in the world. Lastly, right click with the knife. Alright, so. And use a knife. It yields two experience. So. Oh. There we hit. There we are. That's some arrow shafts for you. But, uh, looks like the sun is still up. My goodness. Let's actually take a look to see where it is. Uh, out here, I suppose. Whoop. Oh, wait, I forgot. I built out down there, but not up here. OK. 
Okay. I suppose down there, down here, we'll be able to see the sun out here. All right. Okay. So it is coming down, but uh, let's get right into this business. And let's just spam it. There we go. Okay, so it's from the side. If you right click it from the side, but not the top. There we go. And there we have it. Uh, half a stack of arrow shafts. So let's actually get some more. There we are. It's eight. There we go. Oops. Have to get from the side. And now, hopefully, we'll be able to do this. So this ought to produce plenty of arrows. Ah, spam that leveling. Yeah, look at that fletching. Wow, level 5 already. Okay, I think that's enough. My goodness, that's a lot of arrows. That is a lot of arrows. Even for Minecraft, that's a lot of arrows. Okay, and it's starting night. So I think this is a great place to stop. And... I will be seeing you all next time on Awotos. Over and out.